If you like this video, please subscribe, comment and press the bell icon. Before going to the main part of the tutorial, watch this part and compare the 3D model and the isometric drawing. If you have any doubt, please comment. Let us have a look at the material list. Mark number 1 is pipe, bevel end, schedule 20, submerged arc welded. SAW indicates this pipe is rolled from a steel plate. This is not a ready-made pipe. Mark number 2 is 2-inch dia, bevel ended seamless pipe. SMLS stands for seamless. Mark number 3 is an equal T. And BW stands for but weld. Mark number 4 is a 45 degree large radius elbow. Mark number 5 is a weld -alit. Mark number 6 is a hose coupling. Mark number 7 is a weld neck flange with raised face. Mark number 8 also is weld neck flange with raised face. Mark number 9 is spiral wound metallic gasket. Mark number 10 also is spiral wound metallic gasket. Mark number 11 is 28 mm dia, 159 mm long stud bolt with two numbers each, nuts and washers. This item is an alloy steel made. Mark number 12 is also stud bolts. The dia is 16 mm and the length is 83 mm. Mark number 13 is a blind flange with raised face. Mark number 14 is a flanged gate valve with raised face. FLG stands for raised face. Now let us have a look at the drawing for more details. Look at the elevation, E stands for East N for North and CL, EL for Center Elevation at this particular point. The difference between a FW and a FFW weld is that an additional length of pipe is added to the calculated dimension at a FFW for field trim allowance. See the 45 degree elbow. It changes the direction of the piping spool 45 degree down and to the south. See, one more field weld. Don't forget to add additional length to the pipe. See the T. The branch end is turned up 45 degree to the north. Pipe support 130. You need to check the additional drawing of this drawing for more details. What is this? The Pipig has a 1 is to 500 slope towards west direction.
From this point, the line size changes from 20 inch to 2 inch. A 20 inch blind flange is drilled and a 2 inch weldolet is welded on it. Item number 14 is a 2 inch gate valve. Important things to remember before starting the shop fabrication. What is the size of the pipe? How many spools are there? How many shop welds are there? How many field welds are there? Type of welding. Types of fittings. Line slope etc. There are 7 spools in this drawing. For numbers field welds are there. Can you tell, how many shop welds are there? For the quantity and size of the fittings please check the material list. Thank you for watching. Good day.